only on Fox 6 tonight. Our Bill Miston is here with exactly how things unraveled. Bill? Hey there, Mary. Today, Ryan Borgwart's wife filed for legal separation. Borgwart appeared in a Green Lake County courtroom yesterday, nearly 24 hours after turning himself in. But as we uncovered in a now sealed search warrant, there's so much more to this story. Searchers plied the depths of Green Lake in August, looking for Ryan Borgwart's body. This is a big story in a town of a thousand. It captivated those who call Green Lake home. You just think for the family how horrible that is. For months, people in Green Lake thought Borgwart was dead. But court filings say the 45 year old father of three and husband from Watertown was nearly 6,000 miles away in the Caucasus at a hotel in the country of Georgia, alive with a woman and 5,500 bucks. On December 10th, Ryan arrived on U.S. soil. He eventually turned himself into the Green Lake County Sheriff's Office. What was it in those conversations with Mr. Borgward that made him change his mind? That's, uh, that's going to be up to him uh, someday. The sheriff didn't detail much of the investigation. Now Fox 6 has new details about how this happened and potentially why. Fox 6 was able to get a look at a sealed search warrant. Borgwart took out a $375,000 life insurance policy months before his disappearance. Investigators learned he said he wanted to protect his family in case something happened to him. A text file on Borgwart's computer named Promise dates back to at least early April and shows messages between Borgwart and another woman planning a life together. Investigators learned at the time of Borgward's disappearance, he had thousands of dollars of credit card debt hidden from his family. Filings say Borgward applied for a second passport in April. That passport was used to enter into Canada through the Detroit Windsor Tunnel on August 12th, the day after he went missing. Borgward changed his banking information and cleared his hard drive, or so he thought. Investigators found those messages and the name of a woman, which eventually led to Borgward. Good evening. He sent this video to investigators in November as they worked to convince him to return to the U.S. Borgward appeared in court Wednesday on a misdemeanor obstruction charge. Did you think he would come back? I honestly did not think he would come back. We're a small town. It's a big deal. You know, you just wasted a lot of manpower. Now, a judge gave Borgward a $500 signature bond and was ordered to surrender his passport. Borgward was then released from jail yesterday afternoon and following his court hearing. He's due back in Green Lake County Court next month to see if he can get an attorney. So many interesting things in there. So many people, you just feel for the family, his family that he tried to leave behind and now he's back. What is the difference between a legal separation and a divorce? Well, a legal separation is just that. A divorce completely ends a marriage. A legal separation, the marriage is still in place. However, uh, that can be converted to a uh, divorce at some point after a certain period of time. So right. the marriage stays in place at this point and we'll But she's requesting she wants sole possession of the kids, things that you would say just the marriage is still in, in, place. in, in the in the uh, filings, it says that it's irretrievably broken. The things that were deleted from the files there, he thought that they were deleted, they were able to treat. Will those hold up in court? Were those where he deleted the files, mm -hmm. he thought that they were deleted, but they found them. They were able to... Yeah, and investigators were able to look, in, in, and based on reading the criminal complaint, it appears that he did back up his computer for his wife yeah. here mm -hmm. uh, to make sure that she had information, but it appears that he backed up too much information, mm -hmm. according to the complaint, and that's what investigators were able to yeah. figure out some breadcrumbs right. there. And you yeah. can see kind of the work that was put into this case. Bill missed it. Appreciate yeah. it. Great stuff Thanks. in there. Thanks. Yeah, good digging.